Hi, it's Julie Davison. Today I'm going to show you how to make this little box using the tag topper punch to make a decorative edge. This is the scallop tag topper punch. We also have an angled tag topper punch that has more of a straight line. And you can use the tag topper punches to make traditional tags to put on your cards, scrapbook pages, or gifts. So here's the angled tag topper punch there. And here I use the scallop tag topper punch to pull to punch both sides of the tags for a different look. So today I'm going to show you how to use that tag topper punch to make a box. So we're going to start with some real red cardstock and the long piece is two inches wide by six and a half inches long. Now all of your pieces are going to be two and a half or two inches wide in order to fit inside the punch. So we're going to stick one end in and push down to create the tag and as you can see it even punches the hole perfectly in the center there. We're also going to punch the other side so I'm going to turn around and put it back into the punch and punch again so that I have two sides um, that are punched. I've already scored the cardstock and I scored that at two and three quarter inch and three and three quarter inch so that I have one inch there at the bottom and, um, and you can see the sort of outline of our box there. I've got two more pieces of real red cardstock and these are one and a half inch squares. So one and a half inches by one and a half inches and I scored at one quarter inch from each side um, of, the, of the two pieces. And I went ahead and put sticky strip on there and you definitely want to use sticky strip or a strong adhesive like that to hold the box together. So the sticky strip is on um, the outside there and so we're just going to um, stick that to the front and back of the box so that we have our sides. So we do have a little hole there, but you know it doesn't need to be all the way down. It's still going to hold the candy just fine. Okay, we're going to do the other same thing to the other side. We're going to take the sticky strip off and go ahead and fit that into our box. Just like that. So there is the box shape that we have and I take took a piece of the Fresh Prince designer paper and added a little um, stamped tag there and then I just tied it closed with a little bit of ribbon but you could leave it open for a different look altogether. So there you have it, the tag topper punch box. I hope that you like this project and we'll give it a try at home. Thanks for watching. Happy stamping!